Hello, hello, good evening everybody. Good evening and Merry Christmas. I hope everyone had a lovely Christmas. We are now back in the seat after fair warning first up. Just apologise, I've got a bit of a sore neck tonight so I'm not sure how long I'm going to be able to stream tonight. But onwards and upwards. Let's see how we've been doing with our gold making. Now over the Christmas break I've been on a couple of times, not a lot really. I've had some interesting things. Oh look, someone's just bought a binding of agility. So we've got some we've got some activity on the market. So that's a good sign. Let's start. I won't look at my mail just yet. I'm gonna go for a cancel scan because look here, we've only got fourteen thousand gold. Because I've been buying quite a lot of chaos crystals. Last I looked, actually let's have a look straight up chaos crystals because last I looked the market had been reset on chaos crystals and they were at really high. Now my average at the moment, for my 685 I've got at the moment, is 308 which is alright but look at the price of these. These are all at 399 and higher. So once again the supply and demand of chaos crystals has prevented everything from having some decent profits. Now luckily myself and Severi have been trying to, well mainly Severi, have been trying to reset the market on some of the enchants and we've had some success with that. What I could do with just looking at my enchants. Let's do a cancel scan. Not lessers, necks, cloaks, necks and rings. Let's run a cancel scan. I'm imagining with five people on that we've had some undercuts. I haven't been on since, when was the last one? Oh, my bags are on as well. Must remember that, take those off. Yeah, so we've had an undercut on pretty much most things. There's Sununia on all um, at Severi's. Ah, speak of the devil, here you are Severi. Looking at all your auctions here coming up. How's the old reset market been going? Just having a look. Ah, oh, thank you, Silver Lights, Dagon, and Nutella Day for the uh, for the follows in my absence. Thank you for those. So, how are we doing, Severi, on the old um, resets? Agility. Looks like they're holding at quite nice prices, 6,000, 5,600. It's been interesting. Does that mean you've got a lot of stock? What I could do with, because I haven't been able to actually check the prices of everything easily with TSM. So I think the easiest way to do that is to set up a shopping scan. You reset strength and claw also. Okay, that's excellent. You must have lots of stock then, I think, from looking at that. I just cancelled mine off. What I'm going to do is go into my groups for enchanting and I'm going to make a new shopping scan. Um, professions, cloaks, and we're going to make a operation Shopping. I'm going to take that one off. I'm going to make a new one. And we're going to call it Enchant Check. Uh, just trying to get some capital back. You're down to 200k. Ah, yes, that's, that's the trick when you start resetting markets. It does take a lot of gold. Um, okay, so we're going to look for... We're going to just keep everything. We just want to have a look at things, really. So I'm just going to keep everything as it is. And then we can have a look at our groups. So cloaks as enchant check. Next is going to have enchant check. And rings is going to have 
enchant check. So this should basically, if I now do a shopping scan of my cloaks, necks and rings and run a shopping scan, that should hopefully work things out. Hi, do I by chance have Magikas on Battle.net? Um, I don't believe I do. Apologies, I can't pronounce your name because it appears to be all uh, characters. This guy who kept posting at 500 gold cheaper on Mastery, so you left him be after a while. He kept reposting for 300 profit because you were buying them up. Ah. Hmm. So that group didn't work. So what do I need to change on that? Let's have another look. On my operation, shopping, enchant check. Maximum price per item. Let's have a look at 300% DB market. Let's try that. Still higher than before, just waiting for him to sell out. So hopefully this they will sell out, otherwise we'll be a bit stuck. Okay. So this percentage must be coming in at a percentage of 300% DB market. That must be it. Okay, so if I change that um to operations enchant check what should i really look for let's look for hun let's try this a hundred and six percent crafting so i'm going to search and see where things come at in terms of my crafting percentage i wonder if that will work Let's do a shopping scan and let's have a look, see what happens there. So ancient Priestess. Distant Army. Distant Army, yeah, that's the terrible one, isn't it, really? Um, crafting cost is 4338. You posted all at about 130%. Yeah. Um, okay, so it's only showing two, interestingly. So I need to change the ones to show operations, enchant check, show auctions above max price. There we go. Um, what's going to be my best representation? I think I'll keep that. Let's just keep that in. Let's see what shopping scan shows us. Basically, we're just trying to see which ones are going to be the most profit based on a percentage of the crafting cost. So basically, the ones with a higher percentage are the ones with the most profit, which are the agility, the haste, the strength, and the mastery. These are all the highest profit. And then the least amount of profit, i.e. anything that's green, actually costs less to buy than it does to craft at current prices. So looking at Ancient Priestess there, there's that one at 333, and then everything else is at 4898, with a crafting cost of 4231 that is quite tempting to buy that ancient priestess but I know that ancient priestesses have a sale rate of 0.08 which is actually terrible but given it's a crafting cost of 4231 that might actually be worth buying for just the one even though I've only got 14,000 gold what else have we got? distant army which is a terrible, terrible seller. 
which is why obviously you're posting yours down at um, a cheap price just to try and get rid of them which understandably so because I was in a similar place look at that sale rate 0 0.01 yeah you have three on for 3k yeah and then someone else has put three on for 2650 and they still undercut you yeah I think people just want rid of those because they just simply don't sell I mean it's supposed to have a region sale rate of 0 0.05 which for enchants is terrible um, so but the the sale rate I've experienced is a 0 0.01 which is even worse so I think I'll be we I'd be leaving these both of those well alone and then everything that's above a hundred percent is a profit so the smallest profits at the moment is heavy hide which has a jump there from 5,000 to 5,295. So if you were to reset maybe heavy hide, I'd come in at somewhere there. You remove them totally from the operation. Yeah, I think so. I think they're basically, um, in my operations, I've got them down at, actually it's in my enchanting groups. If I have a look at my groups here, my necks are split into average ones, good ones, and rubbish ones. And in rubbish ones, I've got, um, actually you have to see it in the TSM groups, rubbish ones. I've got the distant army is in the rubbish one. Ancient priestess and heavy hide are in the average ones. And the good ones are the hidden satyr, drain soldier, and claw. So that's where I'm at with those. So I've just cancelled the ones I had on. But let's have a look at what we've got here. We've got a few sales. Let's take my cancels. Someone posted at a high price and when you did a restock they were there and you just clicked on them on habit. Yes, that does that does happen. Looking at this, we've got quite a few food sales. And then the odd, we've got three strengths, claws, haste. Okay, quite a few decent ones, 37,000. That's quite a decent amount of sales. I'll pick those up. And then we'll post back on the enchants that I've got see what kind of sales we get tonight auctioning post scan there we go you bought most of mine <laughs> they were caught bystanders ah I see yes that does happen between us I find um, sometimes I end up by it's sometimes simpler just to buy someone else's than wait, wait for them to come on and take them off That's posted those on, and now we're going to have a look. What else did we have? A few more. That are our hexy bag sold. Okay, so decent sales of food as well, which is really nice. And another 24,000 gold. So we need to check on our food. Looking food select those and run a cancel scan on those as well just to see where we're at with everything oh, I've still got my bags in there so we've been undercut on bear tartare and salmon now I was going now that I've got full skills up in cooking I was going to change my cooking operation I don't think it's fully efficient um, what's my crafting for cooking my minimum profits 110% that's not too bad what's my actual auctioning operation for cooking um, I'm posting 
anything that's 106% crafting. Okay, so that's not too bad. I think I'll leave those numbers there. Okay, so let's take that, that, let's turn off bags and run a cancel scan on enchants and cooking. Let's double check everything. Ah, hello RK. Thanks for stopping by and a Merry Christmas to you. But yes, I had a great one here, thank you. Um, lots of quiet time with the family. How was yours? I trust you had a nice time. Managed to get some... Ooh, we'll just, um, retrying failed cancels using wheel mouse. Reload UI. There we go. Yes, I uh, had, had, a, had a lovely Christmas, thank you. Did you get up to anything interesting yourself? Did you make lots of gold is the question. How did you get on with that? Right, back in the game. Do another cancel scan. So we've got 76,000 gold now. So that should be enough gold to at least buy a few restocks. I'm hoping for some decent silk really or stone hide to try and um, up my stocks in those will be the next thing. Oh, and another another crash. Not sure what was that one. Um, cancel scan done. Leave that for the moment. Let's just pick up the mail, and then we can do a post scan. Probably have to do a reload on that though. There we go. Okay, very good to you too. Christmas is good. Managed to get oh, you managed to get a Grumpus mount. Excellent. And your birthday's coming up tomorrow. Excellent. Well, a happy birthday for tomorrow. Okay. That's excellent. Getting the mount. Are you going to use it yourself or are you going to uh, sell it on in a few months time? That's the big question. Right, this may or may not work because I haven't done a reload. Ah, oh, thank you Nutella for the, um, the host. That's very kind of you to return the favour. I hope you had a great Christmas yourself. Right, that's posted on. Let's just double check everything. Could probably do with a restock check. So enchanting. What do we need to restock on enchanting? Folks, next, rings, add to queue. Oh, lots of things here. We run out of versatilities completely. We've only got one haste left. We run out of strengths. And we run out of claws. So we need a whole load of arcana and a whole load of ley light. Of which I don't think I have many at all. No, I've only got 16 ley light. So whilst I may have quite a lot of chaos crystals, I'm running really low on silk. So we need to see if we can stock up on some silk. Um, have we looked up any recently? No, let's go to the favourites. Silk, oh, there we go. <laughs> Set, gonna sell it in a few months. Only farm the dailies on three characters, so I'm holding on to the medallions and mounts you get. Managed to slowly build up to 200k since you started gold making two weeks ago. That's pretty impressive. I'd certainly take those numbers, RK. That's a pretty good going. Oh, look at this. We've got four stacks of 200 at 575. That's slightly higher than I would have liked, but in terms of restocking, that's definitely worth doing. I'm going to buy those. 
for sure. I'm tempted to buy the 24 and leave that 599 on. Keep my averages down. And then there's quite a lot here. 26 of 20. And then someone's put a wall up here at 6 gold. Which I'm tempted to leave up. But I'll take the 26 of 20. Because those will be useful for restocks. Takes me down to 60... 8,000. Now I might go past the wall and just take the 53 and take the 37 and then I might break down just a few of that wall just to give me some stock at 6. That's quite a decent number there. Seeing as I can take shave off that a little bit because it's going to be useful to me to buy them at 6 um, let's get another 50 I think I'm in the same boat as you are okay, I've only got 3 characters to do the um, the dailies and I've been terrible at doing all the dailies so um, I do need to get back on top of my Winter Vale farming see if I can get a few in at least I've got one medallion so far ok I'm going to leave 150 on of those let's double check on Stonehide Leather uh, Stonehide Leather exact what have we got for leather ooh these are cheap 18 at 398 I'll buy those and I'll also buy the three at four and the two stacks of 200 at 599 also useful okay what does that leave me with gold wise 64,000 so hopefully I'll be able to turn those into a whole bunch of laylight ready for our enchanting Right, so I'm going to leave that stocking up. It's going to take a little while. Actually, I'll do a reload of UI. That'll be the quickest way to do these. Bear with me as so I just run through these. And the next lot, let's open these up. That's the only problem with buying all these single ones of silk, is you do end up filling your mailbox with just ones. Be interesting to see what my Laylight average comes out at after all this. Because it'll be based off of the price of the silk and of the stone hide leather averaged out between the two of them. So that will dictate what my profit margins are for my enchants. What's it at the moment? Laylight is sitting at 54 mat cost and Arcana is sitting at 18. It's slightly higher than I usually have it. My silk average is 619. But now the silk average is going down and the stone hide average is 588 so between the two of them that's going to be my average for ley light might be worth checking the auction house to see if there's any ley light in arcana for less than that because that would be useful just to add on to my stocks so whilst that's opening let's check silk 624 see if that changes 606 yeah it's definitely less let's just reload one last time and then we'll be able to go through and do some disenchanting now I had an idea the other day about my disenchanting and enchanting 
and making the braces. There we go. Lots of nice stock of that. Look at that. 1,600 silk with an average price of 588 which means my ley light price now goes down to 5295 and my arcana price is at 1765 so let's just double check on our auctions and see what ley light and arcana is doing so our price was 1765 ah Good evening, Killer Damage. How are you? I hope you had a great Christmas. Thanks for stopping by the stream. I'm actually going to take, seeing as that's very close to my average, I'm going to take the six. Even though it's just six, they get used up so quickly. And I might, I'll leave the one of 20 on. Let's have a look at Laylight. How's that doing? Now my average is at 52, so this coming in at 59 is a little bit more pricey and there's nothing of a decent quantity worth scooping up. So I'm going to leave those. Okay, Ooh, sold a mastery as well, so enchant sales are going, going well. Pick up that arcana and now we can have a have a go on doing a bracer shuffle. Do I need to make any space? That should be enough for a few, I think. What I'm actually going to do, though, is whilst I'm making my braces and filling up, I'm going to do a shopping scan. Close my bag off. There we go. And we're going to have a look at the good stuff and ingredients. See if there's anything that comes up that's underneath my average buy price. I've set this group up to basically only show me things that are under my average buy price. Just got out of bed lol. You've been asleep since yesterday 9pm. Almost a 20 hour sleep. Wow. That is mammoth. Is that down to hardcore partying, killer damage, or is that down to um, illness? Or simply just catching up on sleep? I know I could certainly do with catching up on some. There's a big range of averages here, from 347% to 39%. Which you're going to be worth buying though, that's the question. It didn't party. You are sick. Ah, oh, that's a shame. You were, you were, were ill before Christmas, weren't you? So, sorry to hear it's carried on for so long. Hopefully, you'll be better soon, though, and on the mend after that sleep. I definitely hope so. That's interesting. Slice of bacon's down to under a hundred gold at ninety-seven. Ooh, bronchitis. Youch. Well, I wish you all the best on a speedy recovery with that. Oh, there's actually some wild jade on. Expensive. 499, so I won't be buying any. What else is on that's worth? Foxflower might be worth picking up a few of. I've got 275 of those. Ooh, there's a cheap fell cloth there. I've got 11. But I normally buy those for 20 gold. So to get one for 1 gold 24, that's definitely worth doing. I'll wait for the scan to finish. Oh, my inventory's full, so let's just start destroying a few things. Right, so bargains wise, fell cloth we definitely want. Because normally they're up here. That's 75 gold. So I'm going to take the two and I'm going to take the four. Because this is for my mooncloth robe. So I'll definitely need those. Essence of Undeath. 
I've been stocking up a little bit on those. But again, look, normally I've been purchasing those for 25 gold. So to find them for... Oops. Find them for... Look at the difference there between 106 and 3. So I'll buy that one. Definitely. That leaves us what's next. Oh, that's interesting. My enchants have come here on my shopping scan as well because I hadn't deselected those. Okay, Falcosaur eggs. Do have 300 of them. Don't believe I've been using them for much. 95 silver. Pretty cheap. How many you got at 95 silver? Quite a lot. I'd certainly bring my averages down. Not entirely sure what I've been using Falcosaur Exit in though. Don't think I have. Let's just have a quick look on Wowhead. Falcosaur Egg is used in Uh, reagent for oh the spiced falcosaur omelette which restores health and you become well fed and gain movement and attack speed well that could be useful I could see why someone would want that so let's buy these up and keep my profit margins down Take them all, all the cheap ones, and then that will at least knock my average down. Everything up to there. There we go. And then we're back to chilled meats, of which I've got 42. That's a stack of 99 there, so that's quite a lot. Not sure I need quite that many. There's loads here. It's only for the occasional cooking dailies I need that. So I'm just going to buy the one lot of 99 because that's that's cheap. I'll leave the rest. Fatty bear steak looking quite cheap. I could do with some of that. So I'll take that, that one, take the 11 and then I'm going to take the 1 and the 28. 29 stacks of 200 there. I might buy a couple of those stacks. That's still less than my purchase price of 2 gold. 17. How many do I have? Well, I've actually got 1,500, so I probably don't need. Oh, thank you, Profits TV, for the uh, host. That's very kind of you. Probably don't need to do that. Oh, Cursed Queenfish is looking quite cheap though. I might pick up a few of those. How much have we got that's cheap? There's 25. That's at least one gold off. And 28. I'll take those. What does that leave us with? Black Barracuda. Got 116. Probably do with a few more of those then. What was my purchase price of those? 21 gold. So 15 gold's a definite bargain. Let's take the 22. I'm going to leave the 3. Hop over and get the 126. Um, where are we at? 22 gold. So anything here. There we go. There's the, there's the wall there. Let's take a couple of those. Well, there's actually one of 20. That's a decent number. And then there's 17 of 10. It's slightly less. So I'm going to take those as well. That at least gives me a few more. There we go. Is that all? Yep. Yeah. Okay. What else have we got here? Fatty bear steak we've done. Bacon. Not sure whether to bother with at the moment because I've got quite a lot of it. 
744. Fox flowers. Ooh, Starlight Rose is definitely useful. I've been looking out for some of that. Our normal purchase price is 57. So that 133 at 50 is cheap. It's going to be quite expensive. Yeah, I'm just going to take a bit of a hit on my profits. Not my profits, on my liquid gold, but I'm even tempted to get a couple of these stacks of 200. Starlight Rose is used in one of my main cooking things. I believe it's one of the feasts I'm doing. So purchase at 40... Oh, actually my purchase price is 47 average, so that's no longer worth getting. Box flower though. No, my average is... Oh, no, 24. I was looking at the wrong one. Let's look at my sold. So Foxflower's worth picking up some. Anything under 24. What's a good number here? Uh, the 33 will take. Got a really nice bid price here of one silver. But it's got 48 hours left, so I'm just going to pick it up as it is. It's still quite cheap. And then I'm going to pick up the 10 of 10 at 23. Take those. Okay, and the 52, let's take that. How much do I have on the auction house? Seems I've been re reinvesting a lot of hours gold. A lot of your gold, yes I have. Um, I don't have a lot actually on the auction house at the moment. It's mainly my enchants, which is about 500,000 worth. Um, a lot of my money recently has gone into trying to get Chaos Crystals back to a decent price. Um, I currently have 685 Chaos Crystals with an average purchase price of 308 gold. And the current price, because they've been reset once again, is at 399 gold. So my money has gone all into buying as much Chaos Crystal as I can for a decent price so that I'm not running out of stock. So this is main. the main thing I'm doing now is funneling as much gold as I can into restocking at a decent price. Which is where this shopping scan becomes really useful at picking up bargains which I think I've pretty much picked up most things now. And whilst I'm going to do this TSM destroying, I thought I'd have a go at running a sniper scan whilst I was doing the des destroying. Oh, internal auction error. There we go, that's not a good start. Slash reload. I did have a crash earlier, didn't I? So let's get this back on and then we can do, whilst I'm doing my destroying, I'll also run a sniper scan just to see if there's anything interesting coming up. Now I used um, the new string that Shara posted up on her um, YouTube video. Ah, thank you Pantykins for the, uh, the follow. That's very kind of you. It appeared to be getting any notifications popping up, but... Uh, Hopefully that will not be too delayed. Right. So what I'm going to do... Oh! Speaking of which, yes it is working. There we go. Thank you for the follow. We're going to run the buyout sniper and see if anything actually comes up with that. I have tried it earlier and it wasn't really giving me anything. So I don't know whether the string I've put in is working or not. I think pretty much everyone is like that or even worse only been undercut on the big enchants like once all day. Yes, I think so, Severi. I think this particular server has real supply problems and something like Chaos Crystals is not easy to get decent numbers en masse um, because I can't think of any way you could farm them and get lots in one go. 
short of you know, got nether shards, you got dungeon runs. Ah, hi Asakura, thanks for stopping by. Is that a new new sniper string from Shera? Or just new to me new to me. It's new to me, I've never really used Sniper before. This string I've put in was the one from her video that she did about the TSM4 beta first impressions. Um, so it's quite old now, um, but I've just I just copied the string in, not fully knowing whether it works or not. Um, but it is kind of I haven't seen any results come up yet, so I don't know whether it's my server that's slow, or I'm not giving it enough time, or I've just um, copied in the string incorrectly. So I just thought I'd give it a go whilst I was doing that personal loot thing thing before you were able to disenchant. Also, enchant was in the group. And how many epic just end up in the in the vendor? Yeah, that's true. That's the one you have. It does take a while for it to find it. Okay, thank you, Oscar. Thanks for the. I wasn't sure because I haven't really been giving it a lot of time, so I don't know whether it works or not. Um, certainly on my server because I think my server is quite slow in terms of number of auctions. Um, but I thought it'd be something interesting to do whilst I was doing the destroying of all my braces. At least this way, you know, we're having a look at the auction house and we can have a look at any bargains that might come up. Um, we never know. Could be interesting. Um, but yeah, it's certainly better than just watching me click destroy next all the time. We could at least have a look, see if there's any decent... I mean, not that I've got a lot of capital. I've only got 43,000 left now. Which is why I need to get these enchants back up and running. With decent stock levels. We've got Chaos Crystals stocked up for a bit. Now we need to get Ley Light stocked up. And the best way I can do that is with all my Silk Braces and Stonehide Braces. We're getting there slowly. Hope you had a uh, good Christmas, Asakura. And uh, welcome back to the stream. Post holiday break. I'm still on holiday myself until until the new year, so uh, I'm trying to make the most of my time. Got a bit of a sore neck tonight, though, so I'm not sure how long I'm going to be able to stream tonight. But we're doing all right so far. Oh, last few coming in. Got no idea what I've got ley light or bloods wise from this batch because my chat's hidden. But at least we can see the sniper scan running. So we're almost there. I think I've still got some more braces to make. So hopefully I can leave the sniper scan running. There we go. It was good. Um, happy girls staying with me until New Year's, which is nice. Excellent. That's good here. Nice bit of family time, Asakira. Um, here, we, yeah, we've been having some great bit of family time. Played lots of board games and uh, spent time with the family. So, uh, very chilled and relaxing for me. Alright, let's make a whole load more braces. Um, let's do create all here. Then we can have them side by side. And then we can at least see if anything pops up on the sniper whilst we're making braces. And then, at least then we should have a decent amount of, of ley light after this lot. Certainly at a decent price as well, which is the main thing now. We need to make sure that our profit margins are high so that each enchant that sells actually sells for a decent amount. Between 
cheap materials and the excellent work Severi has been doing on resetting the market and getting better prices for all our enchants, I think we should be in a good position now to make some money back. I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to do goal-wise with my money now. Now that I've gotten six months game time, I guess to make sure I've got another six months game time in the bag would be useful. And then also I want to save up enough money so that when the pre-release for the expansion comes out I can buy it all with Battle.net balance. That will be the next thing so it's really going to be a question of accumulating tokens as much as I can over the next couple of months. I guess will be my next gold making goal. And I don't know when the expansion's going to be made available to pre-order or even when 735 is going to come out so it's going to be interesting. Uh, what if I gold has a slightly different variation of the string which I find more deals with might be worth a look. Uh, try and find it if you like. Yes that would be useful thank you Asakura. Um, because we're certainly we've not gotten anything coming up yet on the sniper scan. Um, we've had it running a little while. I mean, I'm tempted. Is there some very simple string I could put in just to see what we could get that's cheap? I haven't tried the bid one either. That would be also useful to test out. See whether that works any better. Oh, inventory's full. So we can get rid of that. Slash TSM destroy. Okay, we're going to move this across a little bit so we can see what we're making. As well as our sniper action here. There we go, let's move that there. Now we can disenchant these at the same time. And we can see what's coming up. I think you can see that and yes you can. It all pops up just above my head. And now we can see what's being made. We can see what's potential deals are coming up in the sniper. Of which nothing so far. And we can destroy at the same time. Multitasking at its best. Ooh, there's the blood of Sargeras coming in. What else have we got coming on tonight? We need to do the cooking dailies. Um, didn't do those this morning. We need to also go check out Nomi, see if we can pick up some more recipes. Um, we need to do Winter's Veil. Vale. See if I can get all three of my characters doing them now. My demon hunter needs to go open up a portal. And what else needs to happen? He needs to get the flight path if he can't get the portal. He's now got a level 3 garrison, so that part's complete. My troll's all set up, so... I can hop over to my troll quite easily to pick up the Winter's Veil vale for that one. At the cooking dailies, I'm not sure if I've done those today or not. I have to just double check. I think I might have done one of them. Can't remember this morning. It's all turned into a bit of a blur with a with the holiday season. It's it's always tricky to... I've got no idea even what day it is. Ooh, hang on, it's Wednesday, isn't it? Because there was reset. Because um, there was the server maintenance this morning, wasn't there? For those of us that were on at crazy early times, not able to sleep. Um, so I'm thinking... That means, because we did that mythic last week, I should actually have something in my chest for the first time in forever. 
We should do a cancel scan whilst there. Hmm. That's worth doing as well, Saviri. There's um have there been undercut since we since I've been on? I don't think I'm getting much joy. Oh, it wasn't a mythic plus. Okay, so does it have to be a mythic plus to get the chest? Okay, that's worth knowing. Just a regular mythic doesn't do the chest. Ah. Well, that's all right. Okay. Ah, okay. The mythic plus pluses are even harder, aren't they? So, I think I've only ever done one. I did a plus six once. And that was about it. The only one I've ever done. Right. Um, okay, let's cancel the scan. Let's have a look. And in my food, cloaks next. Yeah, let's run a cancel scan. Whilst this is going through the last ones. See if we had any undercuts in that time. There we go. You got a plus 17 upper cara. <laughs> uh. I think that's way beyond my league. But thank you for the offer, Siviri. Yeah, plus 17 sounds way, way beyond my eye level. <laughs> Few undercuts, intellect, hidden satire, and mastery. Okay. Oh, and a few, a few other bits of food. Okay. Oh, we've got a chaos crystal just at the end there. That was useful. Cancel all of these. Oh. Subscribe before submitting. Um. Cancel. Scan. Retrying by failed auctions using scroll wheel reload UI. There we go. And you have a plus 19 lower cara. <laughs> Can't find anyone to do it with. Wow. Plus 19. I guess people do do those, don't they? I mean, if I was a serious player of the end game, then I could imagine, you know, if, if you know all the mechanics and all that sort of stuff. But as a casual player who has no idea about the mechanics, because I just haven't done any of the dungeons that often. Okay, let's open all these up. How are we doing on Laylight? 151. That's not bad. Still got a little bit of silk left. Um, let's do a little post scan of what we've got. Probably do with doing a few of those enchants. Whilst I've got some of them need going on completely. Uh, like the claw, I definitely need one of. And let's do three claws. And then let's also switch to the UI, do a lay shatter. And then we can post these up whilst it's doing those. There we go. You hate Kara. <laughs> Is lower Kara the one where you start, you have a, like a big one and then you go small? Or is that upper Kara? I never remember which one's which. Right, so that's posted. Um, doing some lay shatters. Ooh, how much do we need? That's upper, is it? Ah, okay. I do always get those mixed up. We need, let's just look at gathering. Let's do a start gathering. 
and move this here so we can see what we need arcana oh god we need loads of arcana absolutely loads okay at least we can make let's make a haste and a couple of versatilities and a strength so we've at least got a few of these on and we can at least post a few on and get some decent everything's run out now yes it has okay let's run a post scan I can hear a cat to my left having a funny five minutes but I can't look because my neck's sore which is interesting okay so here's a few missing bits so let's pop those on lower is the worst of all dungeons oh okay one to avoid then perhaps right so we still need an absolute load of arcana and in order to get that we need to make our braces so back to the braces make another 43 and whilst we're making those let's also run our sniper scan there we go oh there we go oh you found the alternative string okay right let's copy that and okay so in the string now where did I put it last time it was in TSM um, operations sniper I had Shara's string which is that one I'm gonna make a new one Oops, there's Sniper. This is always tricky to move. TSM destroying window. Keeps on jumping. Alright, let's move that there. Let's add a new one. Whoops. Um, added new Sniper operation. Let's reload the UI. Okay, I think I killed it. I may be doing too many things at once. Well, I do remember last time I was trying to put these strings in, they were having a bit of a problem. Ought to really change the default one. Perhaps that one would be the better one to do. Uh, let's stop gathering. And let's have a look at what strings I've got. Um, so my groups operation is for the base group using Shara string so what I'm gonna do is change my operation to this new one sniper new operation edit alt string call it that delete everything paste that in hopefully that will work Oops. your custom price was incorrect okay did I fail to put something in delete that all paste home enter no didn't seem to like that it just says the price was incorrect. Check DB Market. I wonder if we just do a test. Let's do a test of um, what should we look at? Um, Five percent. Eighty-five percent. What would we want? Something like um, 
Missing one parenthesis at the end. Let's have a look. Um, alt string. Home, shift, end, delete. Make sure all of that's correct. Copy that. I wonder, that's got three at the end. Four instead of three. One, two, three, four. Yes. It looks like it would have four, wouldn't it? There's four on the left and then probably four on the right. Think that worked? Difficult to tell. Yes, I don't I think that's worked. Brilliant. Well spotted, Severi. Counting the um the lefts and the rights, that does seem to match up. So that's alt string. If we now go into groups, base group, group operations, and we'll change move that over there and change we're going to take that sniper operation off we're going to put on the alt string for the base group and what I might do is I did have them on all of these as an override I think I'll take those off override Uh, sniper, take the overrides off, and then this should appear. You got lucky. <laughs> it always always helps to have an extra pair of eyes over your shoulder for this kind of thing, because it it's easy to miss something, and you can't see the whole picture. I think this should be the way I set up strings. I'm literally just taking off all these custom ones I did put for every group and I'm just going to do a base sniper setting that I can do on the base group. I think that should work. Okay, that's them all taken off so now the base group is just the alt string. So let's have a look and run my out sniper whilst we destroy these. See if that works. Cool. It's exciting doing something new as well. The main thing I'm looking for is just seeing if it actually works. I want to see something pop up here. Let's just move this over. Oh look, we've sold a binding of intellect in that time. That's excellent. There we go. Moved everything over so we can see. At least we're getting some bloods here with this as well. Don't know how many bloods I've got right now, but definitely worth having a few. I could do with checking my world quest as well, actually. Right. I guess it does take a while for it to scan all the auction house first, doesn't it? Just the last pages at least. Is it the last or the first? With the buyout it's the first. Ooh, look, another sale of trained soldier. So we're definitely getting some good sales here. I look forward to when um, TSM4 has the audio cue back in for uh, sales. I do miss that. It's the last one. Okay. Oh, and a trained soldier and a mastery and another mastery. This isn't you severely resetting the markets, is it? <laughs> Two trained soldiers in a short space of time. That's unusual. Two masteries, I'd expect. No, it's not you. Okay. I did wander for a minute there. I was going to have a look at my auctions. Yeah, the trained soldiers are by two different people. But the they've done a trained soldier, an intellect, and two masteries. 
You've got 28 masteries in your bag already. Wow. That's loads. Well, we've had some good sales in this past hour. It's 37,000 coming in. So, uh, apologies if I'm undercutting you all, all your 28, um, Severi. Um, I'm just going to do a check. Actually, no, we wanted to keep that sniper running whilst I did this. Right, let's... There we go. Curse board, add-ons. I sold more. Ah! What's this add-on? I sold. Combination of abandoned auction I sold. Plays cash register sound whenever an auction sounds. Ah, oh, excellent. Okay, so that's that's a um that will be whilst um I can put that on whilst I'm uh, waiting for TSM to update theirs. Okay, cool. Thanks for that, Asagura. I'll uh I won't add that on now, but I'll put that on after the stream. And a few strengths still. Sold out all claw though. That's pretty good. I didn't mind the 800 price rise. Well, you know, if that's the price, that's the price, isn't it? Right, where am I at with my braces? Have I got any more left to make? Another eight. Okay, let's make those whilst we run the buyout again. There we go. Okay. Might as well just make these last ones. We can close that down and do slash TSM dis destroy. There we go. Oh, what did I just sell there? Nightborn Galaxy Platter. Okay, that's cool. Okay. So let's go through these. Done. And now we can do. What I need to do is send a whole load of braces to. No, send all the stone hide to my demon hunter. Um, and we've also got a sale there, 5,000. So that's our bit of shopping we had from earlier. And now we need to do um, TSM groups, mail selected groups. That will send my leather over to my demon hunter. What have I got left now? Fair amount of stuff. Do I need... Right, we've got still got a few enchants to make. Switch over to that. We need Arcana for most of this. So let's head on back. Let's try a bid sniper. I wonder if that does brings up anything. And what else did we need? We we're doing Arcana, weren't we? So let's do a gathering on that. Start gathering. Move that over there so we can see how much arcana we need. Switch that to the regular one. Move this to. Oh, I'm running out of space really. Move this one up here so I can see the number of arcana I need. I'm going to move that there and then do a crate all lay shatter. There we go. So now we can at least make our arcana. Whilst doing the lay shatter, whilst running a sniper scan. There you are. In the meantime, let's see if I can download this cash register add on. And next time I reload, it should hopefully pop in. Uh, show in folder. And I'm going to 
copy that into my WoW directory. Which has interface, add-ons, paste, extract there, and then delete that. So that's already in there. Close that down. Don't need that on now. Close that. Close that. Close that. There we go. Right. How are we doing with Lay Shatter? Still not quite got enough. So I am going to have to swap over to my Demon Hunter to do the last few. Which means my sniper is going to have to end at the moment. Three, two, one, done. Right. So let's swap to this. Is there anything I can make? Um, let's do a versatility. Um, a haste. Let's do another versatility. And then strength. Another haste. Versatility. Another haste. So we've nearly got everything we can do actually. Just missing on the last two. Okay. So stop gathering. Let's post on my auction no auctioning. Don't need the food. Let's just do the enchants and run a post scan. So now we can get few extra enchants on. There we are. Haste, versatility and strength. Get those on. And then we can swap over. Uh, log out. We're going to go to our demon hunter. And do hopefully a fairly quick Enchant shuffle, a uh, bracer shuffle with that stone hide that I had. Try and get myself the last few ley light I need. Still going to need some decent stock of uh, silk and leather though, because my ley light stocks just aren't high enough. I'd like to have at least a thousand ley light in stock. I mean, we're just working on the edge of numbers here, which is less than useful. Let's open this lot up. Okay, how much do we have? Just a few. So we can do Stonehide, Warhide, and 47 Warhide bindings. Let's open up the mailing whilst we're doing this. And then we can mail it as we make it. And that's the easiest way to just keep constantly making Warhide bindings whilst still having enough bag space. So 47, so these can give us another 47, probably 45 ley light I think. Which is uh, enough for at least now. But then we're going to have to think about just trying to get a whole load more silk. Possibly with the old um, silk farm, but I'm not really much of a farmer. I'd rather buy it if I can. Because so, I'm not a multi-boxer. That would have been more useful. It looks like I should be able to make all of this in one go. So I won't have to mail at the same time. The other thing I need to do on this character is drop skinning and pick up disen uh, pick up enchanting so I can disenchant all this rubbish armor he's picked up. Which is another thing for the list. Just anything really that can keep my stock levels going. That's the biggest 
biggest issue I'm having with enchanting at the moment is the lack of stock. Right, is that everything? Nearly, yep. Okay, mail sent. You're done. I'll come back to you for the Winter's Veil. Vale. But for now, let's just concentrate on Samadan's. Samadan's journey in leather, in um, enchanting. We still haven't stocked up on tailoring and cooking yet either. There's still plenty to be doing. All good in the gold making front. Right. Okay, so let's pick up all those braces. Hopefully I've got enough bag space for all of them in one go. Yeah. Lovely. Everything? Yeah. Okay. Nice big list of stuff to disenchant. Let's head over here. Let's run a sniper scan. And do the des destroying at the same time. See if this works. See if we pick up any. I don't know if doing quick sniper scans like this is the best way of doing sniper scans. Normally it's on a second account. Um, but I don't know if I'm leaving it long enough for it to pick up any bargains. Whether it's kind of like warm up time is just not getting enough. Excuse me, I'm just going to have to stretch my leg out. There we go. Try to lose feeling in my feet for a minute. Thankfully my neck's loosened off a little bit, so it's not too uncomfortable tonight. There's a big dragon coming in. Oh, we've got a Chaos Crystal. That's going to help. Help with my prices. And another Blood. That's good. Alright. Ah, oh, thank you, Emery, for the host. Very kind of you. Right, how are we doing? Oops, forgot to click on destroy next. I'm not using the scroll wheel because just in case anything you can fly your demon hunter to get the flight path if you want ah oh, awesome thank you Saviri that uh, might well be useful you'll do the quest also very kind of you um, that's not a bad idea actually because um, otherwise he's going to have to run we'll do we'll do Samadan's um, bits first but yeah if you're still around later on and I haven't given up by then and gone to bed then yes that's definite definite on the to-do list thank you right okay so that's all the ley light looks like nothing's come up on sniper as of yet uh, we've still got two more to make so let's lay shatter few more of these. I want to get at least a couple of rings on the list. That should help. While you're running a sniper, am I, are you able to use the TSM browse? I don't know actually. Just to see if it's flicking through the pages. Ah, okay. 
Um, can't see the browse here, so I'm imagining. Do you mean going to like um, the standard? Oh yeah, it is, isn't it? You can see the search and the thing there. Yes, it's definitely working. It's doing something. Yeah. So I think it is working, Asakura. That's a good point. Thanks for that. So it is. It is working. Okay, so it is working. It's just not finding bargains. Yeah. Looks like my server's not not got a lot in the way of bargains. But that's okay. Um, I can live with that. It's at least something to um, keep on going whilst I'm doing like my restocks and things. So we're going to make... I have to make these. Why can't we make those? Go to WoW UI and then back. Not getting the craft next in queue because we're on tailoring, that's why. There we go. Enchanting? No. Okay, let's exit out of everything and try again. Right, cloak. There we go. Cloak and ring. And I bet you probably need to restock on some more things now with all these sales we had. Cloaks, snacks, rings. Yeah, a few more masteries and trained soldiers. We need some more ley light, of which we have none. And some more arcana, of which we have none. The never ending restock conundrum at the moment with all these sales we've had, which is a good thing. Um, so where are we at with Shaldurai Silk? Are there any other decent bargains? Oh, there's... That's new, isn't it? 560 for 155. What else have we got? Yeah, I'm going to take the 155. Oh, we had the wall, didn't we? which we may need to break down further because we need that silk. So I'm going to take it all. Thank you for your wall. It was very useful in keeping the prices down. But I'm actually going to have to buy your wall because I need your silk. I might even take a good lot of this up to six gold fifty just to give me some decent silk numbers because we need the ley light we just don't have enough ley light and this is still the best pr best way of getting the best prices I'm going to take all of that take that, take that take that, take the fifty there we go, up to 687. Okay, it's just not fine. Take a look at these items. Okay. Now open up all of those. Just take a couple of um, uh, spiked great staff, barbarian spear. Ah. Okay. Are they on the great deals from Undermine? I'll have a look in a minute. I'm just going to take... I'm just going to reload and get all my silk and then I'll have a look at those. I'm going to have a look and see... See whether those are a bargain. That open all the mail. Then we want 
How much silk are we getting through this? Decent number. 196. And reload. Another lot. Thank God for fast reload times though. That's useful. Right, next lot. All singular, but useful. And then we've got one more reload after this. And then we should be done for the silk purchases. And here we go. And oh, we've got the sales in here. A couple of sales. Another 8,000 gold. It's going to be useful. Right, okay. So that's our extra silk stock. So we're going to go to tailoring and we're going to... we can't make the braces. Why can't we make the braces? Are we missing runic catgut? Um, look, we've braces. Yes, we've run out of runic catgut. Ah, okay. 120 chaos of 209 each. Whoa, that's a really cool, Grace. Uh, thanks for stopping by the stream as well. Awesome. Okay, it looks like we're going to have to go to Dalaran to carry on our enchanting restocks. The runic catgut. But whilst we're here, we were going to look up Spiked Grace. Spiked great stuff of agility 15 gold okay so we have a market value of 478 region market value of 3400 okay that sounds good uh, oh, we need to bid on it. Okay. It's a single bid item, not a buyout. Okay, you've been lurking. You took something for your fever. Oh dear. Another ill person. Sorry to hear that, Grace. Feeling, feeling a bit better to sit up and find the deals. <laughs> God bless the phone for that. don't think this is working. Let's try it again. Let's try the other one. Um, Barbarian Spear. Barbarian Spear. Oh, that one's looking quite good. 73 gold. And normally it's 2,600 for a pole arm. 390. Okay, let's give it a go. Uh, might as well buy that one out. What was the other one? Do we actually get that one? Spike great stuff. Spike. What's there? Click on that. Bid. There we go. Cool. We'll give those a um give those a go. Pop those on. Put this one on, at least because we bought that one out. We're not gonna disenchant it. We're gonna shift left click that. Now I need to add that into a group. Let's put this in Old World Drops Region Average. Now the group operation I'm using for this auctioning posting 48 hours uh, that should really be 90 97 or 96 
26, I think, isn't it? Uh, DB region market value average. And what's my 110% DB region? Yeah, let's go with that. Um, so let's go into groups and put this on old world drops barbarian add that one and then we can post that up let's go select all groups oh no that's shopping we want to go auctioning select all groups run post scan and then put all our different bits and pieces on 94% oh yes Default at 955. Excellent. Thank you, Asakura. I knew it was one of them. 94, 95. Mm. Most others default at 95. That's it. I knew I knew there was a, a number that I was forgetting. Right. Um, okay, so our enchants are coming in. Still Sticking a few of these other things that I've got in on. And then we're going to stick this on 7,700. Which is a whole extra zero. Let's see if that sells. Cool. Oh, and someone's just bought two versatilities. So we're going to have to restock on those as well. We're done here in terms of that. We're going to need to go to Dalaran to be able to do any more. So before I finish up all my fashions, I'm going to head on over and see if there's a cooking daily to do. And then once you've done the cooking daily, also go to old Dalaran whilst we're up there and do that cooking daily. Fisherman's one, we know that one. Let's pick up the barrels, isn't it? Uh, where's your barrel gone? Here somewhere. No, it's not. I think that's the one that doesn't have a barrel. Let's try the next one over here take that one and then we can go up here one over here where is it? oh dear there's been a terrible accident you okay, fisherman? Okay. Let's move on. Let's leave the crime scene. What else have we got? There's a barrel here. We can do this one. Let's hope I don't get stitched up for that dead fisherman. I was innocent, I swear it. I'll borrow your barrel though. And we still need a couple, so we need to go down to this one. Go past you to this one. Take that one. And where is am I gonna get my fifth one? Done that one, done that one. I might have to go all the way across here to get my next one. Oop, stuck on the ceiling. There we go. Let's fly across Stormwind. Right, okay. Any more barrels? Here we go. I'll take yours. There we go. Done. OK. 
Okay, cooking quest. Done. Continue. Epicurean's award. Right. Awesome. Um, okay. That's done, that's done. Let's head to Dalaran. And then we can do the other cooking quest and we can pick up some runic catgut. And then we should be alright. Everything alright? What's up? Okay. Into Nomi's kitchen first. Right, what have you got? Prepared ingredients. How, how many prepared ingredients have we got? Can't see any there. Sure I had some. Oh, there we are. Four. Okay, not many. So, what do we need? Lavish Surama Feast. Hungry Magister. Lay blood, we need to do some more lay blood ones. Let's get those going. Okay. And then we can go on. Have we got any missions? Oh, we need to pick up our missions. Oh, we've got the um, couple more. Ah, hello, your fate. How am I doing? Did I have a good Christmas? I did, thank you. Thanks for stopping by the stream. I hope you had a great Christmas yourself. Right, okay, let's pick up these quests. Now I did pick up a load of uh, nether shards the other day. I haven't cashed those in for chaos crystals yet. A load of artifact power. What have we got? More artifact power. Um, now this was really expensive last I looked at it. Oh, that's 600. That's alright, I can do 600. Ooh, and there's a 200% um, gold here. We'll take that one. Yeah, had a good Christmas with, with the kids. Excellent. Good to hear. 131% for that one. I think I'll leave that one. Not quite high enough. And the Dark Zealots have been exhausted, so... Need to restock on those. Okay. And... Artifact power needs to just cash in on. Which will take me up to another trait. I really ought to do whilst I'm here. Is that all of them? Yes, I think it is. Might as well try and get myself up to that 75 mark. So that's... How many is that now? Artifact level 65. Only another 10 to go. Guess I might as well keep on with the artifact power even though I'm late to the day. Late to the party on that one. There we go. Okay, so next up in our list of things to do is Old Dalaran. Oh, we need to get the runic cat gun. Don't forget that. Um, so let's fly to that, I think. Which will be up here. In, down here. And tailoring. Pick up. Runic catgut. Um, let's get a thousand. And then we can fly back 
Nothing else I need to do here, is there, I don't think. No. Well, just the world quest. We need to just... We'll need to check. So, oh, there's an invasion on. Got 15 bacon there. That'll be worth doing. Uh, and there's 40 arcana there for a word of agility. Those could be useful. 1,000 order hall resources there. Okay. A few interesting ones. Won't do those just yet, though. We're going to head back. Still needs to do our garrisons. Our, um... Our Winter's Veil dailies. So, we'll start with... Old Dalaran to get the second cooking daily done. Then we can head to the garrison after that. And then we can do the Winter's Veil for Samadan. And then we can go finish off our enchanting and um, disenchanting for the Ley Light. Restock on our enchants. We need to restock on our food. We need to restock on tailoring. Still loads to do. Right, sewer stew. We need the carrots. Right, okay. That's outside. I know that much. Let's see if I can remember the location this time. Let's fly down. Now, I think it was about down here somewhere. Wasn't that one? Or was it? No, I don't think it was that one. Um, was it this one? Looking for the ruins. Near the ruins. We had some satyrs nearby. I just need to remember it on the map. That would be more useful. This looks familiar. Any carrots? Not that I can see. Ah, there's one. We found it. So on the map, it's literally just underneath. Okay. To remember that next time. Whenever I do this again, I need to just go straight down. And there should be one more somewhere. Ah, there it is, between the trees. Okay, so that's the carrots. Uh, should be able to make this straight away. Oh, someone's bought the binding of strength. Let's reload. Let's just do a quick reload. I have to do a complete WoW interface um, reload to get that add-on working properly. I think at least we've got it on now. Right, okay. Sewer stew, let's go this way. Then we can fly round. Up and over. And 
You need to exit and open the game. Yes, I do think so, Severi, I think. Just had that realization as I was doing the slash reload. I actually need to do full on full on restart. Okay, we'll have to leave that for another time perhaps. Right, and this one in sewer stew continue. See you later. Open the bag, get another Epicureans award. Excellent. So we're now up to 55 Epicureans awards, so just over halfway with that. Um, I don't need to do anything more now, so I'm going to port straight to my garrison. And then we can pick up all the usual Let's see if Dorothy 2 is there. Let's uh, pick up our herbs, our hex weave, and then pick up the Winter's Veil. Might as well check on these missions because we might get some rush orders. Resources, XP, XP, and there's some rush orders. Excellent. Um, anything at 100 that's useful. Um, garrison resources. That looks interesting. What's that? Um, so I'll do that. And uh, that looks like some good XP. Do that one. That looks like some good XP. We'll do that one. And that one. And I don't know what this uh, oil's for. Tanan Jungle. Fuel naval missions. Yeah, I'll just leave that for now. Don't need to worry about that. Okay, those will do. That'll be enough. And then we'll have a look, see who we've got. Ah! Samantha Scarlet, the herb trader. Okay, we don't have all of those, unfortunately. But I think they are in the guild vault. Or my bank, rather. Some in my bag. Some in the banks. We're going to have to come back here with some herbs which is annoying who was that there? oh it was SI 7 ok pick those up ok we'll head on over see who we've got in the trader Sumptuous fur is cheap, so let's pick up a load of sumptuous fur. How much we get? How much can we afford to get? 50? And another couple. Lovely. Thank you very much. And we'll pick up our herbs. It's a shame the um, Legion Herbalism um, enchant doesn't work on your gloves for this. I've got I put the enchant on my gloves to see if it would go quicker, but it didn't work unfortunately. Maybe it only works if you've got herbalism as an actual profession. Or it just works on um, gore petal gentle gasp grasp. Gore petal gentle grasp. Is that is that you and your fever, Grace, or is that an actual thing? Speed you up. Ah, okay. Thank you, Grace. For a minute there, I thought you were delirious with your fever. <laughs> it's an actual thing. Okay. Right, okay. And... Pick up our hex weave. Oh dear. Not found any threats. Well, thank you, Windows Antivirus. It's good to know. There we go. More hex weave. 
Now we can head over to... It's in a chest, sounds like it, definitely. <laughs> Pick up our quests. Accept. Accept. And accept. And pop through our portal. There we are. Easily done. Right. Let's head head on our horse. And do the first winter's veil vale quests. We're not doing too bad with our little daily routines. It took us a bit longer to do our enchanting because we had to do all the the silk weave shuffle. Um, but we did at least get a load of enchants on. We are still going to have to restock though, so we need to get back to that. But we did at least get some on. Should have done the food and the tailoring before going off and doing this, really. They had a chance on the auction house. I'll get back to those, I think, soon enough. Once we've done these quests, just turn on my objectives. Then we can do the old Grumpus. Might as well join a group, see if there's anyone doing Grumpus. I'll join and there we go, do a few of these whilst I'm here. Grumpus is there, could do the damage. There we go, do some AoE, Grumpus, Grumpling. Another one done, and then we need to free the children. Oh no, that one's already done. Let's see if we can join. Oh no, we were already in one, we could have stayed in that one actually. That would have been more useful. Things everyone does the same ones anyway. There we go. Free some children. Might as well singly do these and some gifts. Then a grumpling, we can do one of those. Then we've got some gifts. They're here. No children in there. Where else have we got some stuff? Uh, some more gifts there. That's a grumpling. Where are all the children gone? Check down here. No one there. Oh, I've done the children anyway. Uh, just to the grumplings left. Okay, we'll do you. Find me a grumpling. And one more. Might as well go on my way out. This one looks interesting. Do you? And done. Okay, da 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 da. All done. Can't hearth back, so we'll have to ride on Mr. Horse. We'll just run through these, don't mind me. Okay, Let's see if I can remember the way all the way down, and then we've got. Um, What have we got? We've got, we've got to go through the snow. 
really do wish I could fly here. I'm kind of tempted to use my medallion to try and get myself better on flying, but then it kind of, that's all my, um, oh, I'm PvP'd. Interesting. I want to really leave the party. Not in a party, but there we go. Alright, I want to go this way. Five minutes, the PvP will come off. Okay. Is it here? This doesn't look right. I think we need to go round. There we go. That looks right. And through we go. Okay. What do we get? Reckoning our savage gift today. More oil, perhaps? Let's hop on the horse. Have a look. Hello, Fluffmorn. Right, children. And that one, and Grumpus. And presents. And then we want to browse your goods. We want Savage Gift. And we want to open the Savage Gift. Yeah. Ooh, we've got another medallion. That's two of those now. Currently at 8,700. They're also now revered with Trader Joe's, the guild. Excellent. Okay, so heading back to Stormwinds now. With the next thing. And then we can at least get on with uh don't think we can sell that's junk. A couple of things there. Sell that. I could really do with putting that medallion in the bank so I don't accidentally consume it. I believe I did have a spot for it. Yeah, there's one there. I'm going to put one there. So we've got two of them. Right, so what are we missing on our enchants? We needed to do some braces, didn't we? Let's head back into the auction house and we can make our braces. Classic UI, you've got 45 braces to make. Let's create those whilst also bringing up. Ooh, let's do a cancel scan actually. Got a few sales coming in. I reckon cancel scan on just the deselect all groups. Let's do food. Cloaks, necks, and rings, and do a cancel scan on those. It's reset day, so it's been busy. Yes, I think so. Um, people upgrading their equipment's always going to be useful. I find Thursday evenings are also a good evening. Um, and then obviously Saturdays, really busy. There's a few... A few undercuts on the enchants and a few on the food. We'll do those. Right, let's cancel all of these. If you do twenty, everything cancelled, confirming the last one. Having a bit of a problem with that last one. I'll leave that to work out what it's doing whilst I do these braces. And then once the braces are done, I can do... You're prepared for tomorrow also. Excellent, Saviri. That's the best way. Stay on, stay frequent. Lots of cancel scans. And I think we're in a good position. Okay, um, so let's change to sniper mode. 
and run the sniper whilst we do destroy next on all of these just in case we happen to find any bargains and then I'm going to pick up those cancels that I did make the spare enchants put those back on and that's enchanting in a better place should really go and pick up those enchants first and get them back on that's only a few braces what did we have 47 I think it was so it shouldn't take me too long to get these done Meanwhile, it looks like there's some sort of duel going on behind me in the auction house. I don't normally get all this activity in my quiet dwarven district. Mainly ley like shards, but that's good. We do need loads of these. I'm almost tempted to start buying ley like shards as well. Depends on the prices of silk and leather. If they start going too high, then buying them will also be a viable option. I mean, I'm getting decent amounts of bloods of Sargeras, so that's that's a good alternative, though. We've got a couple already there. I haven't done any world quests yet either. So much to do. Like Sephorium said the other day, you're never done with WoW. One does not simply stop playing WoW. It's an all-consuming game. Always something you can be doing. I'm not even sure I'm being fully effective with my time doing all these disenchants. I mean, I'm being effective with my prices. My profit margins are as good as they can be, really. But is my time spent disenchanting? I mean, yes, I've got the sniper running now, so that's a bonus. But yeah, it's a bit of a tricky one. Okay, last couple, and then we can do... Done. Okay, nothing on the sniper, so actually what we'll do is we'll bring up our enchanting. We need we need Arcana mainly. So while sniper's still running, let's do some lay shatters. Do we also need next? Yeah, we need thirty. Do we need a lot of this lay like for the next? Hold on a minute. Let's make these first. We need the trained soldiers. And how much more do we need? Mastery, we need a couple more. Actually, we've got in. Oh, no, not quite enough for everything. Let's just do a few more lay shatters. Oh, just running low. Might not have quite enough. We get 21 out of that last seven, hopefully, which is just enough to make that binding of intellect. Right, okay, let's pick up from the mail the last lot. Literally just had enough. And 16,000 gold collected from the sales. That's pretty good going. Take that. And then I'll repost these on. Move this over to the middle. Auctioning. Uh, food you don't need to do. We're just doing the enchants. We'll run a post scan on these. So mastery's back on. Trained soldiers on. Intellects on. Even satyrs on. Loads of stuff. Big numbers with the reset. Yes, definitely, um, Severi. Those resets have really helped with the profit margins. We're getting some decent profit out of all of these, which is really good to see. Okay, so we also need to look at, that's the enchants done. We also need to look at cooking. 
and restocking on our cooking. Ooh, there's loads of stuff here for 6,000 profit. So let's make the bear tartare first because that's easy without a cooking fire. And then we're going to need to do some gathering for this lot. Move this over to this side. Turn on our intermediate crafts. Go visit the guild vault. For most of our cooking stuff. We might need to visit the vendor as well. Looks like we're a bit low on some stuff. Uh, gather items. Oh, actually, no, we're not doing. Calculate a bit. Even if you buy cows at four fifty, you still make a profit. Less, but still a profit. Well, that's pretty good, isn't it? Four fifty. So, so that's basically you've pushed by by you reset, resetting the market on those. You've pushed the effective threshold of chaos up way higher. That might even be. If I have my chaos at the price it's at, it might be worth me just buying Leylight and Arcana straight up and save myself a lot of time. I mean, yes, I've got 24 bloods at the moment. I could do with some more with the shuffle. Um, but that could be worth considering from a time money point of view. Not bothering with the Bracer shuffle and just picking up Leylight and Arcana. It's an idea anyway. Um, right, cooking. Crafting. You did that today, it was faster and sometimes cheaper than flipping braces. Yes, definitely. It can be it can be quite a chore doing all the braces. I mean yes you do get the odd chance of a chaos crystal and yes it's cost effective, but it's not necessarily time effective. Okay, salt and pepper shank. Let's make a load of these. I need to do some uh, intermediate crafts. Let's just put these on first. Labicue ribs. And Surma Surf and Turf. I need some Barracuda Murglar. That needs to be added into the queue. How many do we need? Four. Add to queue. There we go. And that should be enough for some lavish Surma feasts. And everything else we should have. So Hungry Magister. This is where the big profits are in these ones, the 3,000 with each of these. That's not too bad though. Didn't take long to do. And I haven't even got the chef's hat yet. Wonder whether it's worth making some more lavish Suramar feasts because they have been selling now. Need to double check on that. Might be worth making 10 of them or so. Depends how much raiding guilds are active on this server. Don't think there's that many, to be honest. Turn those off. Just going to do the food post scan. Oh, someone's bought critical strike. There we are. Quite a few level sales for that. Let's get our food on. Done. Right, and over to tailoring. What could we do tailoring wise? Bags. Oh, we need to do a hex weave cloth. Let's just do the daily on that. Hex. Hex weave cloth. Add to queue. Create. Done. Um, have we got enough to make a bag? Let's have a look. Uh, 
our groups, bags, and pretty clothes that sell. No, just the hex weave bag. Everything else we've stocked up on, it would appear. The bag we can't do. We don't have quite enough yet. Okay, so no, no more of that. Uh, let's just double check our favourites, Arcana and Leylight. I wonder if it's worth picking up a few. Got the 8, 22 gold here versus my 18 gold. It's because you use so much of it though, that's the problem. I mean it would be tempting to pick up all this lot at um, 39. But then that would be my profits going down. I still do prefer the Bracer Shuffle because the difference in price is quite a lot there. Whereas this one, the Ley Lights, my mat cost is 56. The 57 is quite close. Ooh, look at that. Someone's, someone's definitely put a mark in the sand there. Put 600 up. Now, much as I would like to buy those, I wonder whether it's worth it. So mine's at 56 and they're at 57. Yeah, that's definitely close enough. I'm going to be buying those. Those ley lights are now going to be bought. This is going to take me quite a while to break down this wall. Luckily with the scroll wheel it does make it a lot easier. Now I don't like to normally break down walls because they're really useful for keeping prices low. But that's actually quite a decent price for me based off of my current ley light costs. So I'll take that price and I'll buy them all. It's going to take me a long time in the mailbox to open all of these. At least this is going to give me a really good stock of ley light. Hopefully I've got enough gold to buy it all. Don't have a lot of gold. 59,000. But we do have quite a few sales coming in. 14,000. He's probably flipping braces too. Yes. I imagine so, but at that price, that's close to my flip price of 56. So it wouldn't be much profit there unless he was able to get loads of silk a lot cheaper, which is certainly possible. I know my silk's not the cheapest at the moment. The price I've been getting it for. I have had it cheaper certainly before. If you were able to farm, if you were able to multi-box farm a whole load of silk, which is certainly doable, then you could turn that easily into ley light and do a shuffle like this and stick a load on. But for me, for convenience, having not done a silk farm and not having that much ley light to shuffle, Actually, this is going to be really handy just to keep my stock levels a bit higher. Obviously, it's just a pain to have to buy them all singularly. If it was three stacks of 200, it would have been a lot easier, which is why it's a wall. Thankfully, TSM makes breaking down walls if you so require, actually quite easy. I think I'm going to go the whole hog and buy them all. Or should I just leave one? Just as a token wall gesture. I mean there is one, one stack of five below it. Yeah, oh, we bought them anyway. There we go. Okay, I'm going to take the five as well, just just for fun. There we go. Anything else we could do with looking up? Uh, oh, we went through these mainly anyway. 
Let's just double check for Nomi snacks. Didn't see them pop up on my list. 887 were out there. You do the bear farm a bit every day. You get three to four stacks of fatty bear in like 20 minutes. But then again, you're a druid. Yes, that's a good point. Right, okay. So we're going to open these up. This is going to take quite a while to pick up all this ley light. So we've got 519 chaos left with an average purchase price of 297. So that's really good. This is going to give us a good 600 ley light, which is going to be really useful which we can also turn into Arcana. So stock levels wise, we're looking quite healthy. What did we have? 24 bloods as well. So that's not too bad. Now I know there's more I could probably be doing in terms of world quests and the other Winter's Veils, but I think I'm going to have to wrap up the stream fairly soon because it's getting quite late and I can feel my neck going. I'll do a couple of these and I'll save the rest for another time I think. Yeah I think I'll save those there. Don't want to just go through all of those reloads and end it there so I think it'll be better to end it with a quick restock on enchants. Cloaks, next rings. What do we need? One of each of these, which needs Arcana. So switch to our UI. Let's do a quick lay shatter. So we've got three rings, and then we can restock on those. I think that'd be a good point to stop the stream there. One, wait for this to get to two, and then three. That should be enough. There you go, that's up to three. That should be strength, versatility, critical strike. Another load of profit if those sell, which they probably will. Uh, auctioning, turn off the food, enchanting. Oh, it's just rings we've got, so let's put those on post scan. What do your profits look like now on strength, haste, agility, claw, and mastery? Because they were a bit different than mine this morning. They were a little bit, weren't they? Um, let's have a look. Um, Um, what was I missing there? I had made one and it hadn't gone through. Let's just make sure our necks and cloaks are on. Go scan. There we go, there's a cloak strength we were missing. Um, let's have a look. So, uh, these are all looking quite healthy. Critical strike, haste and mastery are all over a thousand. Haste looking particularly good at 1,600. Agility, intellect and strength are all looking really promising at over 2,000. With strength at 2,800 and agility at 2,700. Those are really strong profits on the cloaks. And that's taking into account the um, Blood of Sargeras price. Mat cost being 266. Arcana's at 18 and Chaos at 296. And then the next, the usual difference, Ancient Priestess and Distant Army are tanked. The Claw's quite good at 2300. Train Soldier's okay at 1200. Heavy Hide's probably the least out of those. Then I haven't got the rank 3's here. The Heavy Hide's at 763. 765, sorry, and Hidden Sato's at 1600. 
So all in all, pretty good I'd say. Decent profits, especially the cloaks, I would say. Yeah, it's the lower average I got in chaos. Yeah, didn't calculate the, the 2k you moved over. Ah, of course, yes, if you've moved it from another server. So my my average purchase price of 296 is really helping there on the profits. Hello, cookie cat. Ooh, tail in the face. Right. So we may be only 36,000 gold, but we have got a lot of stuff coming in. Don't stand on that cat. Mine's 333, yes. Yeah. Went up when there were 399, yeah. I mean, same here when mine went up to that price, all the profits went worse. But we've got some good sales from tonight. We've got five five things sold coming in at 17,000. That's an extra 17,000 to add in, plus all the um, ley light we need to go pick up. So pretty good all in all. Um, thank you everyone for hanging around the stream today. Thank you Saviri for your help with resetting the markets. Um, thank you Asakura for your help with the string and um, the extra add-on for the till register, that's going to be really useful. Um, thank you um, Killer and Grace for sticking by even though you're ill. Um, so yes, thank you everyone who stopped by. Um, thank you for the follows. Um, I hope you've all had a fun time with me this evening and I hope to catch you again. I'll try again tomorrow night, I think. Um, family and illness and neck permitting. Um, until then, have a great evening everyone and I shall see you next time. Doodle pip! <laughs>